Okay, so we've got a lot of stuff moved over and not as much left. So this SD policy, a lot of rules and regulations for what your uh, kernel and folders and files and a lot of stuff like that, Bluetooth loader was the one we were just looking at. So just essentially setting the rules and permissions for who's allowed to do what. So let's copy this, we'll move it over. And this is probably gonna be the biggest bone of contention of the whole thing is getting this SB policy correct. Um, but so far these phones have been remarkably similar. So uh, we might be able to get away with just putting it in there at least to get started. We'll have some errors from it, I'm sure, but we could probably build with this and then uh, work from there. Uh, we could search through our system and try to find, you know, some uh, some of these tools. We do see like file context here and we could compare the file context between the two of them. But even that may not be quite right because that may be for their version of Android and we're building lineage. So these file contexts may change permission between lineage and Omni and anything else. So um, the SD Linux is really probably, in my opinion, one of the hardest parts to get right on a phone. So let's see, notice that it is including a uh, device QCOM SD policy, SD policy make. So we wanna make sure that that QCOM policy that's pointing to for Qualcomm phones, it's probably a generic one. We wanna make sure that that's actually getting downloaded uh, and put in. So you could put, you could make a lineage dependency file to say, hey, if, if you're going to build this, um, you need this file. So let's go to lineage dependency file. Um, Uh, we'll look on GitHub, and we'll steal from the D855. It doesn't really matter. We're just picking one. We just want to save it. Um, we could copy and paste. We could we could download it raw. Uh, either way, we just want to save this this file. So we'll save that link as, and we'll put it into our. <clears throat> into our device where we're building. Let's see, uh, Blue Life 1X2. We'll just save it right in there. We'll close that because we don't need that anymore. Um, and then we'll want to go actually back to Lineage and make sure that we get our file Correct. So we need this device QCOM SD policy. And device QCOM SD policy. Now we see that it's already loaded in here. So we don't necessarily uh, need to tag this as a dependency. It might be a good idea if you were going to build for different ROMs. They may not have that downloaded by default. So we actually don't need this right now. Uh, we're gonna cut it and put it into our downloads folder, but it's just something to be aware of. If you have your device file is pointing to a file that's in some other repository, you probably should link it as a, uh, an include or a dependency so that way you get it for sure. Um, 